Back in May, the Addison Central School District was not able to pass their 2014-15 budget, making them the only district in the area with a failed budget. That's right. Tonight, voters came back out to decide whether or not to pass that revised budget. And WYTV's Nick Quattrini was in Addison tonight, and he brings us more on the story. Nick. Jennifer and Ben, voters came out for round two in the revised 2014-2015 school year budget for Addison passed. The revised budget was passed 341 to 296. Now the revised budget that was passed will preserve all current educational programs and it brings a $36,000 tax levy decrease from the failed budget back in May. And with the passage of this budget, the district was able to avoid a state mandated contingency budget. The contingency budget would have reduced the tax levy by more than $100,000 but the district would have been forced by law to not purchase any new equipment and also it would have been forced to charge organizations for facility use. All the groups and clubs and parents and students that use the facility after school and on weekends for indoor soccer, youth basketball, that type of activity. We're, you know, ecstatic just to, you know, get through it and, um, you know, move on. I mean, there's a lot you have to do once the budget passes and we're, we're closing out one year and rolling into another year. So we're, we're a little behind doing that, but absolutely we're uh, thrilled. And tonight's budget ballot saw a greater turnout with 224 votes more than last month. Reporting in the studio, Nick Wachrini, WENY News.